welcome to the Early College Virtual Orientation. This video is intended for early college dual enrollment students that are taking classes during the 2021-2022 school year. I'd like to start by introducing our staff and providing our contact information. We have Director Jen Tedder, Outreach Specialist Felicia Jenkins and Courtney Warner. Our main email is earlycollege at chattanoogastate.edu. Please feel free to reach out to any of us with questions and concerns throughout the process. Why Chat State? Chat State is a great place to start your college career. Most classes that you take as a dual enrollment student will transfer seamlessly to Tennessee for your universities. I suggest that all students check out this website, tntransferpathway.org. This website will show you degrees that you can start at Chat State and where they will transfer to. You can also look at the curriculum map for the major that you're interested in to see what classes you should take. As a Chat State dual enrollment student, you have access to Chat State campus resources, facilities, and services. This means that you can use our tutoring services. You can come to campus and use the library and even attend sports games. You get a chance to learn from highly qualified faculty during the regular school day on your high school campus, online, or on Chat State's campus. We're excited about fall 2021. We have several course delivery methods. Some of you may be taking an online course. This means that your course happens online anytime. You don't have to log in at a certain time, but you will need to stay on top of your assignments and complete them in a timely manner. You might have readings or discussion boards to do, so it's important that you stay organized. We also might have a virtual class. This is where the class takes place online, but it's at a scheduled time. This means you'll have Zoom conferences or some other video conference at a specific time during the week. Most of you are taking in-person classes. In-person classes happen in person on a schedule. This year, we have several course schedules. Most of you are taking 14-week classes. This means your class will start on August 16th and end on December 9th. Some students might be taking seven-week classes. We have two terms for seven-week classes. The first part of term starts on August 16th and ends on October 1st. The second part of term start, starts on October 11th and ends on December 9th. Be sure that you know which part of term you're signed up for so that you're ready for class the, on day one. Before classes start, it's important that everyone logs into eLearn. This is a very important part of being a Chat State student. For first time users, you'll need to learn your Tiger ID and create a password. You can do that by clicking on Tiger ID A Number Lookup Tool. And then create a password by clicking on Forgot Password. Next, you're going to log in with your Chat State email. Your Chat State email is your Tiger ID at my.chattanoogastate.edu. Your Tiger ID will be a combination of your initials and your last name. You'll get to Tiger Web by going to our main website, chattanoogastate.edu, and clicking on the Tiger paw print. To log in, enter your Chat State email and the password that you created in the previous step. Again, your chat state email is your tiger ID at my.chattanoogastate.edu. Once you're inside Tiger Web, there's a few important things to take note of. The bursar's office link is how you pay your bill if you have one. The email icon is your chat state email. And then the eLearn icon is an important button. It's a little graduation hat. This is where you find your courses. Once you click on the eLearn icon, your courses will be here in this eLearn platform. Every course, whether it's online or in person, has an eLearn presence. If you have an alert, there will be a little dot beside the bell. There's an icon for chat items and an email icon. This is very important. If you need to email your professor, you will want to use the eLearn email. So you'll click on this email button here, the little envelope, to email your professors. There's also a link for resources. These resources have information about tutoring, the writing center, and library resources. In order to find your 
class, click on the square grid for a list of your registered courses. Your courses will not show up until the Friday before classes start. So if you look before the Friday before classes start, you may not see any classes there, but those classes will populate uh, closer to the start of class. Once you click on those list of classes and you find your class, you can click into the class. This is an example of a course that, um, that we have for several dual enrollment students. It's important to look at the course content. The course content is where all of the content for your course will be located. There might be assignments here, there might be readings here, um, there, will, there might be videos here. But it's important that you look at all of the content in the course content. It's important to take note of due date. Most instructors will not accept late work. So it's important that you schedule out your due dates in advance. If you're taking a virtual course with a Zoom meeting, the link will be here as well. Be sure to stay on top of your grades. You can look under the activities tab to see your grades, discussion boards, and Dropbox. Most of your professors will want you to turn in assignments through eLearn and not in email or on paper. Lastly, under the tools section, you will see a place to email your faculty member or to chat with your classmates. I encourage everyone to log in the Friday before classes start to make sure that you are familiar with the eLearn class. As a Chat State dual enrollment student, you have access to all the resources as any other student. So here's some websites for our writing center. This helps you with your papers. Math Center for math tutoring. Our library is a great resource if you're looking for an article or need help with an assignment. And our student handbook is here. The student handbook has all of the policies and procedures for Chattanooga State, as well as more resources for students. If you have any technology issues, here's a phone number to call for student tech support, 697-5595. Some of you may be taking a course that requires proctoring. If you're an online student and your course has a proctored test, you have a couple of different options. You can use a system that we have called HonorLock to take the test from your own computer. Also, most of the high school sites have proctors that can proctor the test from the high school site. Lastly, you have the option to come to the testing center and take the test in person. And the website here uh, has a link to sign up for, for test. Finally, I wanna leave you with our contact information. Again, our main email address is earlycollege at chattanoogastate.edu. Our virtual office is here, library.chattanoogastate.edu slash ecstudent. On our virtual office, we have a live chat we have step-by-step -step directions, contact information, and presentations that will help you learn how to do the important things that you need to do as an early college student. And lastly, our main website is chattanoogastate.edu slash early college. Thanks so much for listening, and we hope you all have a successful early college experience.